Hey guys, Worker Bears, and welcome to my brand new FIFA uh, 17 secondary career mode with Atletico Belgrano. Yep, the Argentinian League. I said this, this one would be the one I hadn't seen a lot of on and I wasn't kidding. Going to the Arden. Because why the hell not? Yeah, why the hell not? It was on the list of countries that could be selected. And it was. And there's actually a familiar name, well, semi familiar. Or I wouldn't know him as well as I'd know. Be familiar with other players, but Matthias Suarez. I'm not sure if it's Matthias or Matt. Everybody, welcome to the match, Martin Tyler. But uh, he, of course, used to play for to this. the uh, Belgian league for Antwerp. And when I came here and saw him there, I was like, oh. So these are, are the, the guys I'm going with. This career mode. Um, yeah. This is the home First team game. lineup. Matthias Suarez yeah. starts making his debut. Now, and it's rounded off the team with these two strikers. Ooh. As you can see, I'm doing something completely different for the first time the ever. I'm playing a three at the back for a career mode. I've never done that before. This could be, this could go horribly wrong. But the team was set to a three-five-two, and I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna mess with that. I'm gonna use it. Never used a three-five-two before. Never. Three back just—it just feels too open, you know. It just looks we'll like how the team shapes you know up. you're inviting wide defenders. Under. Like if you come up against uh, a winger with a lot of pace, it's a debut and you have three sets. Yeah, or back next day, if they get out wide, that's dragging one of your center backs out of place. Yes, you still have two center backs to cover, but it just doesn't feel right. And I've actually picked the Rigoni. formation. Tried to tackle here. He's done that. Shots on here. Now I'm going to use He's next shot well. for my Liverpool promo in 2018. Which, uh, if you if you follow me on Twitter, you will have seen. Switch on the attacking part of the situation. Putting some plans into motion. The goalkeeper about comes out with a punch. For that. And here's the shot. That's a for, good uh, idea. And. It'll be, it'll be interesting. It'll be interesting. Ideas will vary on what EA do with their next game. Or like position changes and such. But uh, that's the formation I am going to run with. If you've not seen it, I won't spoil it, but it is on. That's an offside decision. Well, the players can't believe it. It is on the, it is on my Twitter, which you can find in the, in the description. You should be able to see. What did you make of it, Alan? Actually, well, I thought he was onside, you know, he, but uh, he's gone through and tucked it away. Looking at the replay, yes, he had yeah. gone a bit early. It's gonna stay private, just just for the record. Um, blame, blame a bunch of lucky assholes who decided. They would spam me. So, yeah. I. 
I uh, prioritise my... This point. attack got a bit of menace to it. Oh, he's true. Buck! Better run. Let's go here! There we go. This time, that's a two! Two time. Need to mean car outside. Gets through. to break into. How well they use that space. He's just got too much pace for those defenders. You can see And that has opened the scoring. Scores the first goal of the season. Um, but yeah, the... There's pros and cons to this for a moment. A timely challenge. There's a pro, um, if you want to call it that, is there's more teams in the league. But con means it's going to be a lot shorter because there's only going to be 29 games. There's 30 teams in the Argentinian league. I didn't even think there was that many teams. Like, I thought there was like 20 or something like that. I didn't think there were 30. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Really like, Not a good challenge by the defender. Goes for goal with the header. I like went in to check because I haven't clicked in the argument. Out. I had to go in. I'm like a. She did get a touch on it. Check. I think it was a pretty good effort to. Do that much. League lighting and if there's playoffs or not. He's looking at his defenders. Why would By the way, if there are countries with playoffs, because there were some, um, they are not in. They were not in the running. They, they're not on the list at all. So Argentina got in. I'm trying to think of what else is on my head. I think Mexico. Yeah, Mexico didn't get in because they have a, a playoff system. Because I, I don't want to go through playoffs. It's just a waste of time. It's a waste of my time. Good forward you, play from them. If you're not gonna have the number one be who wins the league, then what's the fucking boy having a league? Well, it was easy on the eye, but in the end, pretty easy to defend against. Another shot. Credit for taking on the show. Now the reason this is going to be sure because there's no cup competition at all. And with there being 30 teams, there's only one game against each team. That's why there is 29 games. So after this, there'll be... So it'll... Strong challenge. So there's about 15 episodes in this. Which is a little shorter than the other career modes, which get about 20 plus episodes, I think. It's going to be the uh, last career mode did 22? The, the, uh, the PS3 one? Yeah, that, that did 22, so that's. that's Doing well to keep so that's ball. about 7 episodes right there. Now, on one hand, that means I'll Alan, what's gone get wrong with this looks off the pace. career mode well, done faster, which will mean uh, I can go on to another one, will be a bit more. which uh, is, is good because there's also there's the uh, situation where I haven't even gotten well, to go to, I, haven't, I still haven't gotten to Syria, I haven't gone to the Bundesliga, I haven't gone to the league, because... Argentina won it. It's fun. Which is fair enough. And there goes the whistle for half time. I mean, the score line is 2 0. It could be the case where I won't even get to go to those countries. Just will it checking be everything is in order. Maybe. Who knows? For the second half to start. We will see. Um, yeah. Be. Very good stuff. I think here. that's perfectly. Sums up this career mode. It's going to be a little more interesting with extra teams, but that also means it's going to be shorter in terms of you're going to lose seven episodes. To be fair, if it were two games against each, team, I mean we'd have 
29 episodes, which would make it probably the second longest after the Liverpool career mode, but that's continuous. Well, it uh, went on for a few weeks, a lot of negotiations by the sound of it, but in the end, about £70 million, pounds, maybe money well spent. And for those of you wondering, you're probably saying to yourself, well, wait a minute, 15 episodes, how is it 15 episodes? Well, it's over hit, isn't it, and it's the goalkeeper's Because point. two episodes per game. To per uh, per episode would be 14, but that's only 28 f 28 games. So the last game will be for the last episode. After which we'll see the celebration. I might include. I'll probably throw in a overview of the squad stats just to fill up that little bit extra time, so the video is not too short. It. Similar to how I did with the PSV career mode last episode because it was just the Champions League final. Well, he's thrown so. possession away. We've reached the hour mark. Half an hour to go. Yeah. So, 15 episodes. Now, I do want to point out that this is going up on... Sunday and you're probably saying and I apologize for those of you who are eagerly awaiting the Grand Theft Auto um, playthrough I want to play it as well trust me um, I'm not it's, it's just sitting there doing nothing on my uh, on my PS4 or, all, all three games are just sitting there doing nothing I mean, I could play one on the other game, but I, I, I want to, I want to go in semi blind because I've played from the front. some of them before. Like I've had a very good moment there. I normally get to a certain point that I get bored, and I've explained this before. I get bored, go on, and just kill, run the random. NPCs and just have a laugh which I'll probably do off screen for the playthroughs so well, they've widened the margin now. Three probably eight. miss about 1500 rests on average per between each episode uh, in each playthrough uh, the reason it hasn't, it's not starting today, and this, don't worry, we're, I'm going to fix this, um, the opposition can take the ball away. I don't know how though, oh that's embarrassing, what a shame for the lad, because, he's getting off his teammates, you're probably saying to yourself, but Monday is a secondary for a month, or now, I might go back, to this might be the perfect way to go back to the regular lineup with Liverpool being on Monday and a secondary career mode be up on Tuesday and so on. Which is probably what I'm gonna do. Save having save you guys from being bombarded with the same career mode two days in a row. And while Yes, this career mode is new. I don't want you guys getting into the point where you're like, oh my god, is he going to put this up every single day? I know it's going to be short, but... You know, I don't, I don't want that to be the case. So, that's probably what's going to happen. The reason the I couldn't do uh, the Grand Theft Auto... Ooh, uh, video yet is because my uh, thumbnail guy hey, sent me the, here comes the counter thumbnail for this career for this oh they've lost out they've wasted series actually. first real counter attacking possibility there like I got on to Benitez. My thing so I had a DM from him on Twitter Not often you get and at this level a game as one sided as this it's great for the team with sure all the goals enough. but I did, just waiting but it 
Damn when I saw it was the second Nerikurama, I was like, okay. Late goals come so, competition. he sent another one the, now. the thumbnail, which on the sidelines. we we'll obviously saw because the half's forward. Could be moved watched off now. This could be it. Even if you only paid half it's attention to it, you saw. He'll say oh, it's a Sunday. Earlier. Yeah, he's having a little go at his teammate. He did want that pass earlier. Now they do need an injection of uh, fresh enthusiasm from the bench. Is this substitution really necessary? It's the 90th minute and this could easily be the last kick of the game. Your man's brought... You know, need some serious luck to even get a touch of the ball. Vega. There you go, there's the full-time whistle. He didn't even get a touch of the ball. There you go. Um, so yeah, the reason this is go, this is up today instead of what should be going up today, and that's the secondary, the, uh, not, not the secondary, but this is the secondary, so I'm not great there. Um, instead of this, it should be, obviously, the GTA 3 playthrough, but... Your man sent me this thumbnail, so I'm working with what he sent me. Um, I'll. He said he'll send me the the new one later, which is probably fine, but I don't know what time, and I want to feel like I'm rushing him, so I didn't feel like I would. I I didn't bother asking him, hey, uh, can you? Uh, be more, a little more uh, clear on what time, and I, I didn't want to be sitting around weighing, looking at my phone, and thinking, will he send it? Will he send it? Will he send it? I didn't want to be that guy, so I said, you know what? I'll I'll, I'll do a secondary career mode video. Oh, introduce the new, who uh, the new career mode with a new team. In a new league, in a new country, and with the uh, this and Grand Theft Auto, we'll just have to wait another week. And I, I know that's not not exactly what you'd want to hear because you know I I understand I really do I I want to play as well and you. I, ho I hope I it's clear. I don't play like I don't play these career modes off camera, uh, and I don't play these playthroughs. When I if I if, if I want to play FIFA, I'd have to go onto an account where I'm not actually doing a career mode at the present time hmm. to even. Get to a situation where I can, you know what? Boom! I can go on there, play a game, game or two of FIFA, and that'll do me for. For the uh, for the day. So, um, that's, 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 that's the situation we're in. What's this? Um, wow, 1.7 million for this guy. Um, he's one of our finest players, but that's a lot of money for an Argentinian to him. Um, ooh. if they can up it to 1.8, I'll accept it. Maybe that's being a little greedy, but that's, that's perfectly, 
halfway between 1.6 and 1 and 2 mil. There you go. The extra 100k wasn't even a problem. Boca Juniors. I don't think Tevis will still be with them. He uh, went to China, didn't he? I think I updated the squads. It's hard to tell because I've... Uh, pretty much everyone on the squad here is a uh, low knee. With, like, the exception of Mateus Suarez. Um, or Matthias, however the fuck you say it. I realize I'm probably going to butcher a whole bunch of names. But you know what? If you didn't want... If you wanted someone who was going to perfectly pronounce every single name, you wouldn't be here. That's for damn sure. And I'm glad that. You come into ground some days and you do get that buzz of excitement. And I've got it here Let's be honest. Looking forward to it. Some of these names I never... <laughs> Start the season. Chance for them to get back in front of their own fans and really announce their intentions this season i think those intentions are going to be good they're going to be strong and they really should be up there competing for the title up against a side that probably is a mid-table side i don't think they're going to be worrying about relegation we well, could yeah. be in what was that Attack now. Omar. And he heads it for goal. That is a terrific header. Really, Gomez? How did they generate some power? Ooh, really bad headers. One you barely connected, and the other or you skied over the bar. Perez. Here the challenge is a good one. Vega. He's coming forward. With some danger. This is how they love to play on the break. It's a brilliant stop. This time he can miss. There we go. Fantastic start. Practically had to walk it in for him. Giving themselves a terrific boost for what lies ahead. Excellent for his team. Easy for him. Well, he's he's laughing and joking about it because it was perhaps the easiest goal he's ever scored in his career. That has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. Berchini. Fabra. Made the challenge well. When it comes to countries that I know next to nothing about, Argentina is definitely up there with at near the top, if not at the very top. Right. All I know from the Argentinian League is Bobby Juniors are one of the best teams. Manager will go into this with uh, extra no. zest, really. Played 1-1. One, one, one. What's going to happen in game number two? Well, results are everything for manager, aren't they? Oh, and I think the players much will more. be gaining respect. I think, is it, well, it there's is someone player. else as well? Is it's it uh, River play or is that this. a It's a real chance country. to at least work the oh, goalkeeper. Right. There's a river play as well? Or is that... I'm, I'm not sure. Here comes the free kick. Goal! Oh! What a goal from the free kick! And that really has given them much more of a basis for the rest of this match. I, just, I wasn't expecting to score that. Yeah, but that's a nice little addition. Yo, the uh, freaking... That mm. is textbook. In game time is almost on sync with my uh, with my uh, recording time. Twenty four. It's I'm a few seconds ahead. Just when the goal here to two nil. Ah, it's crazy. Crazy. Damn it. Good position. Okay. They've worked this attack. Let's go to a lot of them on this. A dangerous position now. The contrary to uh, 
last thing for a while at least. He's towards the end of the game. He moves. I think the keeper had given it up, but not on the back end. In the, all about anticipation. The last week that I started scoring free kicks as well. well that he never started with scoring free kicks. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. And now the shot! What a fine save! I think, I think that's like the second or third free kick I've scored on camera. Goal. So close with that header. Oh, he's I probably have like he really just eight or nine overall. Results. Like, that was a... That was okay, I guess. I mean, it's, it's not like... It's not a Roberto Carla Haas or... Special. It's not anything that, that could be a booking you know, here. Immortalized forever. It's not like, oh my God, it was one of the best free kicks ever. Here, you have to see it. It was. It was an okay. Well, he arrives with a reputation and a bit of a price I mean, tag now, around fifty million pounds. Can he handle it? It's still a good goal, I mean, a free kick. Well, this attack got a bit of menace to it. The free kick would have to be. Good play, but they've lost under the ball now. some very unique to circumstances to be classified as a bad goal. Like if it were a shady free kick nice that shouldn't be awarded, like that one, or if it like took a million deflections on its way in, or if there was a handball or something that. If if there was something shady, then you could say that for a game. In at that, it would be hard to call a free kick bad because you know free kicks are just a unique kind of goal. Even though know, free kick is a staple of of the beautiful game. Whenever they're scored, it's considered you know that was a special moment. That was a good, good goal. goal. Like, that goal right there, that's probably better than the free kick. Because that was just a thing of absolute beauty. But that doesn't mean the free kick was any less. Certainly was. I mean, it, it was a comfortable lead. That. Ooh. Freaking smashed it in. Keeper. Absolutely no chance. He was nowhere near it. Even though he dived the right way. If you can pronounce that guy's name, good. Good for you. I will never be able to pronounce his name. If you're wondering, though, so, um, I found him at kind of Bakshi or got a tussle on. It was some Turkish team. If I could uh, check the second half, it's going to be like the first one-sided on the attack here. And here's the header. He's hit the frame. The shot's on. Oh. Over and then going to his butt. He's was poor. Well, you can score a goal at any point in the game. He's 19, if I'm not mistaken, or maybe 18. And, you know, he has some pretty, pretty decent stats. Maybe you can tell, like, who he plays for from his shirt. Here you can see his uh, positions. Oh, he's 17. He's even younger than I thought he was. I was saying in 18 or 19, he's 70. We'll be hoping for better as the match develops. So, you know. I think the uh, opposition goalkeeper can. We're looking for a defensive minded central midfielder who. That amount of shots you can see on your screen. I don't know his potential. Get away here. I don't know his exact potential, but. You know, well to stop that one. If he might be one you might say. Yeah, yeah. For him, maybe in the next week. Excellent interception. 
Nice move. That's something that I might. Defender. The score! That's got in. Off the goalkeeper indeed. You know, something about the high 60s, low 70s, because you never know, they might be something special. And you just don't know it because you just found them randomly. Like, I don't know if I told this story before about how I found Luis Suarez. And the home it was a um, few FIFAs ago, before Suarez ever joined Liverpool. I was playing a heading for the exit career mode with uh, Barcelona. Building steadily here, keeping possession. Well, they've got a set piece specialist. Haven't they? And I signed up this Uruguayan kid from Ajax. And it looks like it's a case of just trying to freshen the team up. No idea who he was at the time. Didn't realize he'd be. He won the best strikers to ever grace the Berm, the league. He, in a few years, and they would end up playing for my team. I uh, praised the on them. Some potential in this move. And tore up, up as he tore her Premier League defenses to shreds. Because I'm. I'm not sure he hit that exactly as he would have. Kind of doing here with. Against Boca Juniors. In the net. Um, but yeah, <laughs> like he had a, like AA rating. I was like, who the hell is this guy? Between these two teams and that goal. I don't know what AI signed him. I think he was still a winger in that game. I don't know. Maybe it was. Rightly so. Well in the league. I'm trying to think. Did maybe Messi retired? I don't know. I think I think Messi he didn't retire he he handed a transfer request that five bill in the game you know, cuz sometimes your best players if you leave them out for one or two games cuz you're trying to rest them all of a sudden all oh, they had a transfer request so yeah that happened with Messi he went to Real Madrid because they were pretty much the only team who could afford him and at that, my board sold him. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. So I, I, I went in search. Here's a chance to attack. And I found in Suarez. No chance. Terrific stop. Corner I can't remember lead. what FIFA it was. But it was before he joined Liverpool. Ooh. I remember when the new... Who's about Suarez's transfer came? Oh, I was like, I know that name from somewhere. And then one of my friends said to me, "You signed him in a career mode." Very nearly a goal. It's hit the I was like, it's "Oh, it's the same guy." I, I legitimately, I just thought it was ha like there's tons of players who share the same name. I mean, the opposition now they're here. We had we had another Ronaldo. Well, defensively, I was like. I, I knew his name was Suarez. I didn't actually know it, his name was Luis Suarez. I just so heard Suarez. I was like, well, there's a billion players. There's probably named Suarez in the world. It's a very common surname. I mean, like, if you search FIFA, there's about 15 of them. So, I was like, it, initially, I actually thought it was Matthias. I was like, that, that's what I thought it was, because he was the most, he was probably the most recognizable Suarez at the time. Like, it was only when your, my, my friend said it was Luis Suarez, is that I signed in the career mode, it was the same guy, I was like, wow. It's not the first time that it's happened where Liverpool have signed a player I've used in the past. It's a weird, weird thing. Like, and it's a headed effort at goal. Fantastic goal! I remember a few FIFAs. It's before they, we signed him in real life. 
Who did I sign in a little pool crew remote? Uh, some, some Spanish guy named Fernando Torres. Yeah. No kidding. Hmm. And it also happened with Joel Matip. I used him in a previous FIFA with Liverpool. Signed for Liverpool. Well, the match a long time over here. 6 0 now. Fernando Gago. And, um. I think it was. It's happened with a few players. But he's been stopped. I'm trying to think of the names off the top of my head. He's coming forward with some danger. And the verdict is another four minutes of added time. And the cross coming in. And he heads it for goal. So they're setting up for the corner. Shots on here. Shot blocked here. Luis Suarez. Like, the odds that I sign... I mean... Yeah... In Luis' case, it was with a different team. It wasn't with Liverpool. But, weirdly enough, it was with Barcelona, who Suarez would join when he left Liverpool. So, in a way, I kind of like... In that, I predicted he would be a Barcelona player, only skipping the Liverpool part. Because he was still at Ajax. I don't know how. Like I said, he was 88 rated or something like that. This was bef This was. I only know what rating he started out on in that FIFA. Because, like, like I said, I didn't know who he was. I legit did not know who he was. So, that's a nice, interesting little detail. And, uh, yeah. This was a good start. Two games, two wins, six points. And I finish up the transfer window. Man is gone for 1.8 million. Uh, just before I end, I will quickly just go through the players, and you can see. I'll, go, I'll use this. You can see where they are from. Uh, this goalkeeper is on loan from. A Polish team. 66 rated. This guy's on loan from Nottingham Forest. Braga. This guy is a natural Bel Belgrano player. Or I didn't sign him. Oh, it's Trazen Sport. Sorry. It's Trazen Sport. It's not uh, Fenerbahce or uh, Galatasaray. Adams is on loan from New York Red Bulls. Blake is uh, on loan from RB Leipzig. This uh, Japanese guy is uh, on loan from that Kaw Ka Kawasaki front. Apologies to all Japanese people if I butcher that, which I probably did. Matias Suarez. Vega here is on loan from Toluca in the uh, Mexican League. And Jose Gomez here is on loan from Benfica. I think this guy's on loan as well. Yeah, he's on loan from Philadelphia. Natural. I think this guy was here when I got here. Because I don't recognize him as a player I brought in. And these are all players who are already here or I. So, yeah, there you go. Uh, so, in case you. I mean, you could just look those players up. But, you know, now you know exactly where to find them in case you're interested. You'll see more from the how on 
Tuesday. Until then, thanks for watching. I'm Joy. Smash the like button for the brand new secondary career mode. And until next time, I hope you all have a very, very nice day.